Hey everybody, it's John, aka Golden John Ion, with another quick hit computer tip. Here's a quick question. Do you need to create a Gmail account but not entirely sure how to do that? Well, don't worry. By the end of this video, you will know how. First thing you need to do is open a browser and go to gmail.com. Once there, select the Create Account link. Select who this account will be created for, but in this video, I am going to select for myself. After selecting Next, you'll be asked to input your first and last name. Then you will be asked to create an email account and password. Once completed, select Next. On this screen, you will be asked to verify the account with a cell phone number. Select the country, then input your 10-digit phone number, and then click on the Next button. After this, you'll be brought to a screen to verify your phone. At this time, a text will be sent to your phone with a code. Type this exact code in the verification area and select the verification button. On the next screen, you'll be asked to give an optional recovery email account, a date of birth, and then finally a gender. Once filled out, select Next. At this point, you will be taken to a screen where you have to accept the terms of services. Select Agree to finish your account. And there you have it. You have now successfully created a Gmail account for yourself. But wait, hold on a second there. What if I don't have a cell phone number to verify this account? What if I don't even have a telephone number to verify this account? How the hell am I even going to create this thing? Don't worry. I have a trick for this. For this method, you will need access to a smart device with a Wi-Fi internet connection, or you can virtualize a smart device on a computer with a software called BlueStacks. Check out my next video on how to install and use BlueStacks. Go to the settings of your smart device, then select Accounts, and tap on the Add Account button. Once you see the sign-in screen, tap on the Create Account button, and then fill out the requested information. Please note that you will need to input an age of 16 years of age or younger to not be verified with a phone number. Once this account is created, you can sign in and correct the age. And there you have it. Now you have a Gmail account to send all your correspondence to and from. And that's where we're going to end this video. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more videos.